Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Marlene and in today's video I have the purple installment of my Rainbow Haul series from Sheen. If you're new here and don't know what that means, it basically means my family shop these hauls for me following the colors of the rainbow. The entire haul is shopped in just that one color and we have gone through all the colors of the rainbow. We have now landed on purple and I have an entire bag full of purple items ordered by my 16 year old son. It was a little bit scary. So basically that's the whole point of it. I don't know what's in the bag until it lands because it's ordered by my family. We follow the one color and all the other videos are linked in the description box. So I think that's it. Let's get stuck into it. Okay, okay, what do we got? We have a pair of trousers. They look to be on the shorter side. I would say ankle grazer, straight leg. I love the color of these. These beads are sewn onto here. I hope they will stay put, but they are very, very cute. We have a side zip and then we have the belt actually sewn straight onto the trousers. I have to say, I love these trousers. I think they're very, very cute. I love the color. Let's jump into them. These trousers are really cute. I actually really, really like them. I love the deep purple color of them. I think they are so beautiful. The length, it's definitely more like summer trousers in the fabric as well, in the length. But I'm hoping that I'll be able to save them maybe with a pair of sock boots. I'm hoping that would look good. I don't know. Um, I love the little tie detail we have here in the front. I think that's very pretty. And the beads, as I said, I do like them. I do worry that they might not stay put. Now, however, the side zip. Now, these trousers, I can close them. It's not because I don't have room enough to close them. But side sips always get stuck in those bloody seams that are for the waistband. I detest these kind of sips because no matter your size, no matter your shape, it's a battle to get these clothes. And when they put them in the side, when as a plus size girl, you have to twist and pull and... <clears throat> no, it, it's moving on, moving on. They are gorgeous, these trousers. I actually really, really like them. Yeah, I think he did a good job with these. Okay. This is cute. Do you know what? I guarantee you Michael would have ordered this because he thought I wouldn't like it because he, I, I would think it was very granny. I love this. This knit is so blooming soft. It fully opens, fully opens. I'm gonna pop this on straight away because this is adorable. That would look so good with the trousers we just had, wouldn't it? I love this. Oh my God, this is adorable. It fits me absolutely perfect. I could close that if I wanted to, but I'm not one for closing my cardigans. I love this. Black pair of skinny jeans, black top, and then just cardigan over it and you are good to go. I bloom and love this, Mike. Oh, so far so good. I, d I, d I don't know what to say. My 16 year old son has ordered me a pair of Victorian style gloves. Now, I'm not saying I don't love them. I'm not saying I don't wish that I lived in that era where I would have to wear a corset and look dolled up every day. Actually, just put me into Downton Abbey, that would do. Um, but in this day and age, what the heck am I gonna use a pair of gloves like this for? They're not like winter gloves or anything, but do you know what they do have? They have like little rubber kind of knobs on there. Is that the right way to say it? I don't know. Okay, they're adorable. Mm. Okay, okay. This kid had fun when he was ordering this haul because I'm um, going from Victorian style gloves to a little purple frog ring. Okay, th this is adorable. I'm not gonna lie to you, but when am I ever going to wear a frog ring? The only finger I can fit it on is my little finger. So yeah, um... Frog ring and Victorian gloves. Okay, what have we got? What have we got? Okay, we got some tulle. We got a big, oh, this looks like a dress. Oh, wow. This is very interesting and very, very different. I don't know if he intended me to wear gloves with this. This is absolutely gorgeous. I don't know if it's my color, but look at this here. This is a tulle overlay where you have little flowers on and a lot of embroidering in it. You have a little kind of puff sleeve out here, but you do have the straps up on your shoulders. We have a seam here in the middle underneath the bust, and we do have a zip down in the back. Now, one thing, 
this material is a bit like parachute material, very polyester. I do love the aesthetic of this dress, I have to say. I hope I can fit it because this is actually beautiful. I won't say I don't like this dress because I do love the aesthetic of it. I think it's a very, very pretty color. Unfortunately, I have another one of those stupid, annoying hidden zips that no one can close on their own. So although I think the fit of the dress is fine, I can't close it on my own and everybody else in the house is away. Do you know what? As I was putting this dress on, I kind of thought, do you know what? This reminds me more of a costume. If you were to dress up like a princess, I'm getting Aurora vibes out of this dress. The fabric is just more costume than it's an actually proper dress. Does that make sense? What the devil? That's the back. That's the front. What the devil is this? This looks like a massive oversized pajama top, but there was no bottoms in the bag. Okay, again, I love the color and this lavender color is like so hot for autumn. You know me, I do love myself a little lace. But, oh my God. Um, I really don't know what to say. Um, okay, do you know what? This is one of those that I'm going to have to play around with and style. It's definitely going to need a good iron. Is it better when it's tucked in? I'm gonna have to play around with this and style this and see, it, it definitely needs a good iron, that's for sure, but you will never guess what this kid has ordered me. He has ordered me a pair of socks with toes in it. First of all, I very extremely rarely wear socks and then with toes in them. <laughs> I hate wearing socks. Mm. this is a heavy bag and it's very purple i think we got we got two pieces this looks to be a tracksuit yep tracksuit bottoms and a top okay i actually like this look at this i love this sit going down long sleeve elasticated cuffs and elasticated bottoms um, nice wide band down the bottom there and then actually bottoms just the same plain color now for me uh, the bottoms normally would be a little bit oversized because I'm bigger on the top half than I am the bottom half but this is gorgeous okay this is not bad it's very purple and as purple is not one of my favorite colors I'm a bit on the fence with it. Now the trousers fit me absolutely perfect. I have plenty of room in them, yet they still have a good fit even on the back side. The top fit me absolutely perfect in the chest and it is elasticated underneath the bust here. Um, and it's quite a strong elastic. It really sits and stays. I'm really, really missing pockets in these trousers. I think pockets would have made it perfect. Would I have bought it myself? Probably not. But not a bad choice, not a bad choice. Seriously, look at this. What the heck is this? What do I even say to this? What am I ever going to do with these? Oh. We got John Lennon glasses. There you go, rock on. Peace. Yeah. Okay, I... Am I wrong saying these are actually nice? <laughs> I like these. They don't suit me at all, but... Okay, um, two pair of glasses in purple. Um, We can get purple glasses on Sheen, so we've established that. Okay, this looks like we have another dress. Oh, wow. Look at this. This is very similar to the blue one we had not that long ago in another haul. This is very similar to the other fancy dresses that I have from Shein. I love this. Purple is not my favorite color, I'm not going to lie to you, but you know what? We're just gonna pop that on and then we'll talk about the details. I do wonder what inspired my son to actually pick up a party dress for me. I'm kind of surprised, but you know what? This dress is so beautiful. 
I don't, I'm, I'm really gobsmacked that he picked me up this dress and it fits me absolutely perfect. Now it is a little bit plunging as you can tell, I can see here, you can see my bra there, um, but it fits perfect. We do have the waistband detail around here and then we have the frills going in the front here and it is an overlay so you have the overlay over the skirt. Now the quality of this is just unbelievable. The length of the dresses are also fantastic because they are really, really nice and long. Now I'm five foot five and a half, just for reference. And obviously I would then have some heels on if I was to wear this dress, but there's still plenty of length in it. It's an absolutely stunning dress. I love Sheen's party dresses, prom dresses, whatever they call them. It's beautiful. The last item. Oh, I'm so happy that Michael picked this because you know what? I have this exact same dress in black. It's just a long flowy dress, but it's one of those that you can dress up, you can dress them down. Just one of those versatile pieces. And I actually had it in my basket in purple and he must have seen it there and picked it up. I'm so happy he got this one because I absolutely love this one. Let me pop it on for you. This dress may just seem like a very plain shapeless dress, but you know what? This is one of those dresses that you can dress up and you can dress down. I love this dress. And as I said earlier on, I do have this one in black. And you know what? I used it all bloom and summer. I just love this dress. I'm so glad Mike got this one for me because I absolutely love it. And that is it for today. We have come to the end of yet another haul. And I must say, for a 16 year old kid who has no interest whatsoever in clothes or fashion or any of this sort of stuff, He's not done too bad. I can definitely see that he's taken some of the pieces to a little bit of the extreme just to kind of have a bit of crack with it because that's that's what my son is like. But he's definitely shot a few pieces as well knowing that this were pieces that I would like and that I would really enjoy and actually wear. So I don't think he's done too bad. Now, effectively, this is the end of the rainbow series. Purple is the last color of the rainbow, but don't despair because I love doing this series, so I'm not going to stop it. There are plenty more colors out there that we could have fun with. There are definitely patterns and textures and fabrics and everything else. There's loads more that can be done into these tiny little condensed hauls. So I'm going to keep going, but I better say thank you very much if you made it this far and sat through the ads for me because that's how you're helping my channel. But with all that said and done, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.